This is incredible. The knowledge stored here is overwhelming. It will take me years to decipher it all. What about sealing Atlantis? Have you found a way to do it? Oh, yes, yes, I think so. Well, what is it? The staff. The staff is the key. All right. It's time. I can't. Not yet. Listen to yourself. You've gone mad. You need to accept. Some knowledge was not meant to be had. Knowledge is power. The only power worth having. At what cost? I will not be ordered around or lectured by you. It was your plan to seal this place, and I agreed to help. That was before I realized what we would uncover about the first civilization. The creation of humankind. We are sealing this place to keep the cult from using it to enslave humanity. That is bigger than your quest for knowledge. The cult will be nothing but an insect to swat once the power is ours. It's too dangerous to leave this place open, and you know it. You wouldn't understand. Your pride will cost us all in the end. It's not about pride. What good is knowledge if you curse all of humanity in the process? It's what you wanted to avoid in the first place. Sometimes it's better if we find our own path. Duh, we are not ready for the power this place offers. You're right. I cannot save humanity directly, but I can save it from itself. This is your burden now. Humanity's fate will be decided by the choices you make. I understand. Alexios, choose wisely. Atlantis is too dangerous. I must seal it. Everything in order? Then... Open sesame! So much power! The nodes are interconnected in ways I couldn't imagine! This is more complex than any Isu temple we found. Lisbon! The Arctic! I'm recording everything, Layla. You're going to be a hero for discovering this. Do you see the staff anywhere? Not yet. But there's more to explore. I'll find it. The mechanism should be open. What's wrong? I, I don't know, Layla. I'll check my notes on the Isu. Oh, I see it. There's a beam of light missing. Time to troubleshoot.
looks like it can move. Those pillars seem to have mirrors on them. If you manipulate those light beams, they might illuminate something important. Is it? to be called the Eagle Bearer, but Icaros is long gone. I've been searching for you, but you can't. It's... <laughs> you weren't really looking for me, were you? It works! The Isu artifact, the staff of Hermes Trismegistus. You must have so many questions, Leila.
you know my name? Maybe the gods told me. Maybe I had a vision of the future. Maybe the device in your ear is noisy. Sorry. I came here with a purpose. To find you, and put an end to what I started many centuries ago. I have your spear. Would you like it back? Oh, no. You can keep it. It's broken. But you used it broken. It was powerful. I used it to defeat enemies even Erothotos could not describe. But everything must come to an end. I left it to him when its power was exhausted. Something to remember me by. I... I have so much to tell you. That staff is incredibly important. It kept you alive. How? Ask a student of Hippocrates. I hear he still has some. The staff served its purpose. My friends and I are trying to keep it out of the hands of the Templar Order. Listen to me. Order, chaos. If either triumphs alone, the world dies. I tried to bring an end to chaos, and it has only led to ruin. I used to assist order. Now I fight for choice. Freedom. Chaos. Pythagoras was right. You are the key to the prophecy. You will restore the balance, Leila. I have fought in too many wars. I have seen too many people die. I've traveled from one end of the earth to the other. This belongs to you now. Promise me one thing. Anything. When you are done, destroy it. Destroy them all. So much of the story I haven't seen. I should go back to the Animus and visit Alexios again. What are you two doing here? You know us. Always on your tail. Old Herodotus couldn't wait to see you. I told you, Van Nevis. Sira is said to hold a secret. A secret no one can fathom. Yes, but a lost world? It's perfectly possible. Atlantis may exist. Sounds like Hui to me, but he's insistent about it. Herodotus is right. Atlantis exists. Incredible. It's true. I can't believe it. Tell me everything. My mother sent me here to meet my real father. You know Pythagoras? It's him. Your father was living in a volcano? Pythagoras? That's unthinkable. It would make him immortal. He had a staff that belonged to the ancient civilization. It kept him alive all this time. 
Makes perfect sense. Well, where is he? Invite him along. He's your father, after all. He was a stubborn man. He wanted to keep all of the knowledge of Atlantis to himself. <laughs> stubborn. I suppose that trait runs in the family. He means he's sorry for your loss. It's all right. But none of this can ever pass your lips. This stays between us. You have my word. But the world needs to know. We could tell the most amazing tale of our time. Herodotos. Oh, fine. Then it's settled. Let's move forward. Like always. We've learned a lot, haven't we? You know it all. Speak for yourself. I'm on the hunt for truth. Gods know not all your myths are accurate. They come from the gods themselves, who are the most reliable sources we have. For all we know, anything's possible. And you would know, as the eagle-bearing demigod you are. <laughs> Perhaps he too is immortal. <laughs> <laughs> Sure I am. I do know one thing for certain. This has been an odyssey I won't forget. wrong? My parents. Herodotos. I'm so sorry. I thought I'd be able to see them again. To show them my life's work. But now, I'm sorry to ask this of you. But could you take me to Samos? I need to pay my respects. Of course, my friend. Thank you. I'm not sure I could make this trip alone. Increase speed! Spin the wheel in any direction and you'll find the cultist. The scum's everywhere. Then we have nothing to lose. Nothing but time! Let's track them down! Then set sail. We have a cult to kill.
I used to lay down on the roof and fall asleep under the stars. I always thought of them as something the gods created to guide us. Clues to find our way.
world bows to us. We are the new gods. Poseidon before leaving? Oh, I can make him an offering, all right. What? <laughs> Next time, let's get a call.
in Greece.
This is it. How does it feel being back? It feels like... Uh, words escape me. That's a first. To my eyes, it's home. The smells and sounds are familiar, but it's been so long. I don't know if I can do this. You've done more difficult things. Challenges we overcome always seem easier when they're behind us. What would you do? Hold my head high, walk with purpose, push those feelings of doubt aside. You're right. I suppose we should head to my family home first. Lead the way. was so exciting as a child. How so? There was always a new ship to see, new people to watch, from the sailors, often a new word to learn. <laughs> Most of which got me in trouble. I'm sure your mother remembered those days fondly. I know I do. So many faces I don't recognize. You've been gone a long time. Even so, I was hoping there'd be someone I know, someone who'd remind me of my life before I left. We've only just arrived. It'll be okay. Here we are. This is where I called home for most of my childhood. Most? I came to Samos at a young age, but I was born in Aligarnassos. Those are days I'd rather not remember. Hmm. It doesn't look like it's changed much in my absence. your toys? It was my brother's. I often hid it when he wouldn't let me play with it. This pottery looks special. My father always felt art was a great outlet when things seemed overwhelming. Tablet. Looks like some old writing. The ships never stay for long. Samos is a place people come for a visit, but not to live. Is there something about this place I don't yet see? One of my first writings. I was always restless here. Always wanting to learn more about the world beyond, and the world that was. Those. Mister. Praise the gods! It's been far too long. It has indeed. You're looking well. As are you, Theodorus. I, I should go. I'm glad you're back.
Stop it! This isn't helping. We came to Samos as soon as we could after receiving your letter. I'm a... He's a friend. I couldn't stay here. I needed to leave. At least tell me where they died. I'm sure he's just surprised to see you. His eyes showed hatred. He probably missed you. You'll see. It's a bit late for that. I know this wasn't the welcome you were expecting. But perhaps it was the one I deserved. For now, I only want to see where they died. I owe that to them. I'll come with you. I'd like that. If you're ready, we should go. Waiting to face reality will do me no good. know this island as well as my own home. Seems like a nice place to grow up. It was. I spent a lot of time on my own or with Theodoros and Nistro. My parents are... were influential here. So they were often busy. But it wasn't a life for you. There's only so many ships you can see sail away as a boy before you feel the pull to leave as well. was talking about. My parents used to love walking here. I can't believe 
This is where my parents last stood. Where fate decided to take them from us. I thought I'd write about their history on Samos and all they did one day. But not this soon. I should have been here. Should never have left. There is no point thinking about things you should have done. That doesn't help. But... You're not a fighter, Herodotus. You couldn't have stopped this. Perhaps you're right. I want you to remember that while we're on Samos. I'll try. I just wish I could have seen them once more. Do you have a favorite memory of them? I remember when my father taught me to swim. He tossed me off the side of the dock. I thought I was going to drown, but then I saw what I thought was a shark. I flailed my arms and kicked my legs until I made it to shore, only to see it was Theodorus with a bit of rock above his head. <laughs> I still remember the sound of my father's laugh and the warmth of my mother's embrace. Did your parents like it on Samos? It was more than just a home to them. I saw how happy this place made them and only wanted to feel the same somewhere as well. What did your parents think of your writing? They always encouraged it. It helped that Theodorus was talented as well, although he always felt more drawn to poetry. If it weren't for their support, there's a good chance I would have never pursued it. If there's anything you'd like to say about your parents, you should. I always feel more comfortable writing than I do speaking. I'm not going to judge. And I know they wouldn't either. They meant everything to me. They always encouraged me. I knew they'd be happy for me no matter what. I'm sorry I didn't come back sooner. There was so much I wanted to tell you, to show you. Mother, you were one of the strongest people I knew. You pushed for truth, no matter the obstacle. Father, your compassion is something I won't soon forget. You taught me it was okay to feel for myself and for others. Your names and deeds won't be forgotten. We should head back. They don't belong here. I've never heard of them being on Samos. Something is going on. Maybe Theodorus will know. Watch out! Stay close! Followers of Ares here. I don't understand. The question is whether they came on their own, or someone sent them. Neither outcome is favorable for us, nor Samos. I wonder what my parents would do. Exactly what we're going to do. Protect Samos.
We should see if Theodorus or Mister know anything. 